is Dorian Karankas, and this is my Project 2 screencast video. Um, and here I'm in my memory uh, manager header file. This is pretty straightforward. These are all the files that are given um, in the instructions. Uh, and then I have an additional function that I'll get to later called Zimli R. Um, and here are my private variables, which I'll also get to later um, when talking through the CPP and the function um, and the functions and what they do. And in my CPP, here we have the constructor, which is pretty straightforward. It just sets the allocator equal to whatever allocator is passed, the word size, and it sets my memory address pointer to null, null pointer. The destructor calls shutdown, deletes that memory address pointer that was created, um, pretty straightforward. And so in initialize, I'm given the size of words. And so if this size is less than zero or greater than the maximum size, um, uh, it, will, it will return and throw, uh, throw you in a, an error. Um, and bitmap is created using the size in words and total space is created by multiplying word size by the size in words, um, which is technically the byte, byte total space. And that's where I also have the bytes left, which is different from total space because total space will remain the same while bytes left will be changing um, as a program I guess added memory and then uh, freeze the memory. And so this is where I'll create memory address. However, if memory address was already present, I'll be deleting it and then creating a new one so that I won't have uh, leaks in memory. Shutdown clears these vectors that I'll create later on. Um, bitmap is already created actually, so that's that's uh, a present there. Um, that's all that the shutdown does. And so allocate um, takes in the size of bytes that the user requests, and then it goes through some checks if it's too large or too small um, by comparing it to the bytes left and those rows less than zero. <coughs> and then we call upon list um, and get our, the amount of words we need. Um, this will return the uh, location of the offset int that they should be inputted into, that's best fit or worst fit, whatever that the um, um, allocator was set to in the, in the beginning. Um, if there is no, if there's less than zero, then there's no memory, and it returns. Um, otherwise, um, they are, they are taken, there's a uh, offset bytes of how many places, how many bytes that it needs, um, that the word will fit in, the space that it needs, um, and then the memory address is added on top of the, the current memory address is added to um, as top of the memory address that we created initially, and then the bytes are added to the bitmap. Um, and then the current memory address is returned. Uh, the free takes in that address. The mem locations is where that those addresses were stored previously up here um, in the location's current address. It compares them. If it finds it, uh, then it adds to the bytes left, so you get more bytes um, total, and then it calculates how much space needs to be removed, then goes to the map and removes them. The set allocator just sets in the allocator, pretty straightforward. Dump memory map um, just uses the list to create um, um, a memory app with a string um, and, out, and appends a string with the requested um, whatever the values were inside of the list, which is pretty straightforward and uses F open and F write to write to the um, file given. Um, get list. Um, just uh, this is how you get the list of the function, which goes to the bitmap, finding all the holes and spaces in vector and putting them into vectors, holes, and spaces. And at the end, these vectors um, are used to create that um, list pointer. Um, given the size of the beginning and then the whole space and location, and it returns that list before uh, after clearing those previous vectors. Um, get bitmap. Uh, so this just creates a map um, pointer uh, from the uh, uh, from the bitmap, but it creates it in um, the eight by eight bit uh, values, and it uses uh, a multiplier to multiply each of those values at whatever space they're at, and then adds to them, adds extra zeros if the uh, map size is not divisible by eight. All these just return word size, memory address, total space. And then best fit is what is used in um, finding the best location. So this is just finds the uh, smallest location, the exact size within the bitmap, and this finds the biggest and largest location within the bitmap and returns that location. And so delete R is what I use to delete that list pointer that's given, and this is used in, um, and this is called into the allocate. And so this will make sure that there is no uh, memory that is getting leaked, which is called right here, right here. And here I'll demo my function working with Valgrind. As you can see, it takes a second, and all the tests run, getting 38 out of 38, and there is zero bytes leaked total.